God's awesome creation, the Starolite, the cross of Christ in crystal. The cross of Christ Jesus stands for the agony and suffering that he endured as an outward expression of the boundless love he has for all mankind. In nature, there are many forms of that cross that Jesus suffered on and brought salvation to us through. There is a type of crystal, brown in color and named starolite, which forms the cross. It forms them in 90 or 120 degree angles. Starolite is actually a metamorphic mineral that forms an aluminum rich gneiss and schist. It is a hydrated iron, aluminum silicate, and like garnet, it has the ability to push aside surrounding minerals as it develops into crystals up to four inches long. Starolite resists chemical weathering and so may be left as residual mineral in clay or uh, may be washed away and deposited in a new location by streams. Twined starolite crystals are sometimes called fairy stones and are worn as good luck charms. Crosses have been manufactured from baked clay to resemble a starolite, so when you're obtaining a specimen for a collection, you need to be careful. Starolite is found in Switzerland, France, and Brazil. In the United States, twine starolite crystals are found most abundantly in Georgia and in New Mexico. The beautiful crystal and reminder um, of the nature of Jesus Christ on the cross is a wonderful uh, reminder in nature of the love of God and the endless love that he has for you and I. Well, please like and uh, subscribe, and uh, have a good evening. God bless.